Imagine walking through the bustling streets of your favorite U.S. city, where the skyscrapers reach the clouds and the streets buzz with life. Now, imagine that on the same streets, there are thousands who call these sidewalks home with no roof but the sky. In the United States, a staggering 600,000 people are homeless, a number that might seem distant until you walk the streets of Los Angeles or New York and see the reality up close. These are not just numbers. They are people who once had jobs, homes, and routines. From veterans and teenagers to families and the elderly, homelessness does not discriminate. Homelessness can be defined in many ways, making it a complex issue to address. In our video, we present a list of cities based on reported numbers of unsheltered homeless people, focusing on the raw counts rather than per capita, which might only highlight lesser-known small towns. We aim to draw attention to major cities where the crisis is most visible. Well, my name is Sean, and welcome to Best Blocks. Let's start the countdown. Number 10, New York City. New York City, often celebrated for its vibrant culture and towering skyscrapers, faces a significant challenge with homelessness. Despite being a wealthy city, it has a large number of homeless people. Surprisingly, New York ranks 10th in our list of cities with a homelessness crisis, primarily because it has a unique law that provides many homeless individuals with some form of shelter. This right to shelter law means that while about 80,000 people are homeless in New York, only around 2,500 are unsheltered, living on the streets, in parks, or in subway stations. However, the presence of this law doesn't fully solve the problem. The harsh winters and hot, humid summers make living without a stable home particularly difficult. High living costs and limited affordable housing continue to push many out of their homes. While New Yorkers are known for their generosity, giving food and money to those in need, these acts of kindness are not enough to address the root causes of homelessness. The city's effort to keep most homeless people sheltered is commendable, but it also masks the ongoing crisis. Many still live in temporary housing or depend on the city's shelters, highlighting a persistent issue that needs more than just emergency solutions. New York's struggle with homelessness reflects a broader challenge, showing that even the most developed cities can face significant social issues. Curious about what else we're uncovering? Hit the subscribe button on Best Blocks and never miss out. We're diving deep into the topics that matter and we want you along for the journey. Number nine, Philadelphia. Philadelphia, also known as the city of brotherly love, faces a tough reality with its homelessness issue. It's our ninth city on the list, struggling with around 4,500 people who don't have a home to go to at night. Many sleep outside, even during the city's cold winters and humid summers, because they feel safer there than in shelters. Many homeless people in Philadelphia choose the streets over shelters because they worry about their safety and losing their self-respect in shelter environments. They also don't want to disrupt their daily routines. This choice is often judged harshly by others who might think homelessness is due to poor decisions without considering other serious factors like mental health or financial troubles. The contrast between the historic beauty of Philadelphia and the sight of people sleeping in doorways is stark. Although the city has made efforts to help, the growing visibility of people living in public spaces shows that more needs to be done. This situation calls for better, long-lasting solutions that offer more than just a bed for the night, but a real chance for stability and respect for those affected. Number eight, Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C., the nation's capital, is not only a symbol of America's history and governance, but also home to a significant homelessness crisis. Ranking eighth on our list, the city faces a harsh reality with approximately 4,900 people living unsheltered, enduring the elements day in and day out. The plight of the homeless in Washington, D.C. is exacerbated by the city's wide income inequality. The cost of living is steep, and the disparity between the rich and the poor is starkly visible on the streets, where many without homes find temporary refuge. Sadly, the number of homeless individuals has risen by 11.6% since last year, with an increase in younger people finding themselves without a home and a surge in substance abuse issues among this population. Efforts are underway to address this growing issue, with lawmakers pushing for increased funding to provide more support and resources. However, the visibility of homelessness around the city's monuments and tourist attractions makes it a pressing issue that can't be ignored. High housing costs and deep-rooted racial disparities add layers to the crisis, as a significant portion of the homeless population is black, highlighting systemic issues that need more than just temporary fixes. Washington, D.C.'s struggle with homelessness reminds us that even in the heart of political power, 
there is a profound need for policies that bridge the gap between the affluent and those struggling to survive on the street. Number seven, Las Vegas. Las Vegas, famous for its vibrant nightlife and casinos, faces a starkly different reality away from its glittering strip, a severe homelessness crisis. It's our seventh city on the list, dealing with a situation where many are living without shelter. In Las Vegas, an estimated 5,645 people are without homes, facing daily challenges far removed from the city's image of luxury and entertainment. The streets of Las Vegas tell a different story, where the less fortunate navigate life amidst the backdrop of casinos and tourists. For many homeless youth in the city, the risks are particularly high as they are vulnerable to exploitation, including sex trafficking and prostitution. These young individuals often find themselves homeless due to a variety of factors, such as aging out of the foster care system, lack of stable housing, and difficulty of securing employment without a permanent address. Las Vegas's high cost of living compounds the crisis, making it tough for locals, especially the youth, to afford housing. Despite the city's sunny weather, which might seem ideal, living without a roof here is a harsh reality plagued by safety risks and health concerns. The situation in Las Vegas is a call to action for more than just emergency services. It requires long-term solutions that address the root causes of homelessness, protect vulnerable populations, and provide opportunities for a stable and secure future for all residents. Number six, San Jose, California. San Jose, California, nestled in the heart of Silicon Valley, is known for its tech industry boom and high cost of living. Yet, it's also facing a growing homelessness crisis, placing it sixth on our list. In this city of innovation, over 6,000 people have no place to call home, and the issue is particularly striking among the youth and student populations. In San Jose, the contrast between high-tech wealth and homelessness is stark. An alarming number of students from San Jose State University, about 11%, have reported being homeless at least one day in the past year. These young people often struggle to find affordable housing in an area where rent prices are among the highest in the nation. The city has taken steps to address this crisis by partnering with local organizations to build new apartments specifically for young people. But these won't be ready until 2024. Until then, many students and other young residents continue to face the daily uncertainty of not having a stable place to live. The crisis in San Jose reflects a broader issue that affects many other prosperous areas. The high cost of living can make it nearly impossible for even locals who grew up in the city to afford living there. This problem calls for comprehensive solutions that include affordable housing and support services to help vulnerable populations secure a stable future in the city they call home. Do you have any ideas on how to help solve homelessness? Let us know in the comments below. We're interested in hearing what you think can be done to improve the situation in these cities. Number five, Phoenix, Arizona. Phoenix, Arizona, known for its desert landscapes and sunny climate, faces a severe homelessness crisis, ranking fifth on our list. In Phoenix, about 6,000 people are homeless, confronting extreme weather conditions and a lack of sufficient shelter options. The city's mild winters might attract those needing to stay outdoors, but the scorching summers make it dangerously inhospitable. Despite the weather challenges, Phoenix's homeless population is growing, with the city struggling to provide adequate shelter. The current facilities can accommodate less than half of those in need, forcing many to live in sprawling tent communities that are often deemed unsafe. Many of the city's homeless choose to stay in these encampments rather than moving to shelters due to strict rules that can include curfews and zero-tolerance policies for drug use. For those dealing with substance abuse, these conditions make shelters feel less like a refuge and more like a prison, leaving them to cope on the streets. The situation is further complicated by local residents and neighborhoods pushing for the removal of these encampments, which they see as eyesores and safety hazards. This has created a tense atmosphere in the city where the needs of the homeless and the concerns of the housed residents clash. Phoenix homelessness crisis underscores the urgent need for more compassionate and practical solutions that address the root causes of homelessness, offer more inclusive shelter options, and provide ongoing support to help people regain stability and dignity. Number four, San Diego. San Diego, known for its beautiful weather and scenic beaches, is also facing a severe homelessness crisis, placing it fourth on our list. 
In this sunny city, the homeless population has increased by 32% since last year, with over 10,200 people currently without a stable place to live. Many of these individuals find themselves in sprawling tent encampments, which have become increasingly visible across the city. The situation has become so dire that the San Diego City Council is considering a camping ban to address the encampments, which are seen as a public health and safety hazard. This proposed ban has sparked a heated debate among residents. Some argue that the ban is necessary to clean up the city and reduce safety risks, while others believe it only pushes the homeless out of sight without providing real solutions or support. These tent cities, receiving thousands of complaints each month, pose a significant challenge for city officials who are struggling to keep up with the escalating crisis while trying to maintain quality of life for all residents. The divide between those living comfortably in affluent suburbs and those confronting homelessness daily is stark, highlighting the need for comprehensive and compassionate solutions. San Diego's crisis calls for more than just policy changes. It requires a concerted effort to expand affordable housing, improve support services, and genuinely engage with the underlying issues that drive such widespread homelessness in one of America's most picturesque cities. Number three, San Francisco. San Francisco, famous for its Golden Gate Bridge and tech boom, faces a serious problem. It's the third city on our list for the worst homelessness crisis. The city has almost 38,000 people without homes, a huge number for a city of its size. This has become a big issue that everyone can see throughout San Francisco. The problem gets worse because housing is very expensive and there aren't enough affordable places to live. To help, the city has started programs like giving clean needles to drug users to stop diseases like HIV from spreading. However, some people criticize these programs, saying they don't really solve the main reasons people are homeless and might even make drug problems worse. The crisis is now affecting San Francisco's image and economy. For example, a medical group that used to have big meetings in San Francisco for years has stopped coming because they don't think the city is safe anymore. San Francisco's struggles show that we need real solutions, not just quick fixes. This means building more affordable houses, providing better help for mental health and drug issues, and making policies that tackle the deep reasons behind homelessness. This approach would help more than just putting a Band-Aid on the problem. Number two, Seattle. Seattle, famous for its rain and the Space Needle, has a major homelessness problem. It ranks second on our list, with about 40,000 people living without stable homes. This high number is especially troubling given the city's rainy weather, which makes living outside very hard. Despite various efforts to help, Seattle's homelessness issue continues to grow. The city has declared a state of emergency to draw attention to the crisis and has tried to increase the number of affordable housing units available. However, many people are still without homes, living in shelters or out in the open. The problem is very visible, especially in downtown Seattle, leading to different reactions from the community and local government. The city's plans focus on more than just providing shelter. They are also trying to address the deeper reasons behind homelessness, like mental health challenges, drug addiction, and economic inequality. Living costs in Seattle are very high, and the difference in wealth between the city's rich and poor makes the problem harder to solve. Seattle is working on finding kind and effective ways to deal with homelessness, emphasizing long-term solutions and support services. These efforts aim to help homeless individuals find stability and improve their lives beyond just giving them a place to stay temporarily. Number one, Los Angeles. Los Angeles, known for its Hollywood glamour, holds a less glamorous title as the city with the most severe homelessness crisis in America. It tops our list with an estimated 47,900 to 63,700 people living without homes, where a shocking 70% of them are unsheltered, living on the streets or in makeshift camps. The problem is visible everywhere in Los Angeles, from underpasses filled with tents to sidewalks lined with makeshift shelters. This has pushed the city to its limits, with residents and officials feeling the pressure as the crisis continues to grow. Despite efforts to provide housing and support services, the number of homeless people keeps increasing, highlighting the need for more effective solutions. The high cost of living in Los Angeles, combined with a shortage of affordable housing, has driven many to homelessness. The city's mild climate, often seen as a benefit, ironically makes it easier for people to live outdoors, contributing to the visibility of the problem. Los Angeles is now at a critical point, needing not only immediate relief for those affected, but also long-term strategies to prevent homelessness. 
This includes tackling the root causes like poverty, lack of affordable housing, and insufficient mental health services. The challenge for Los Angeles is not just to manage the current crisis, but to find sustainable solutions that address the underlying issues causing so many to live without homes. Think this was shocking? Wait until you see our next video on the 10 fastest dying states in America. Click here now. What you'll discover may just change how you see our country. And please donate a subscribe to help me reach my goal of 100,000 subscribers this year.